there we are again. Welcome to a metal tier list, metal genre tier list. Sorry, I don't have time to make good videos. That's why I decided to make this. Welcome. And uh, some people on Discord actually asked me if I could do it. So I, I, I thought, yeah, let's do this. Why not? If you don't know what a tier list is, S means super nice and the rest is self-explaining, you know. By the way, if you like this point of view and nonsense videos, I have a Let's Play channel. Link is in the video description. Check it out if you like. Thank you very much. Ah, this is fun. Look how much fun this is. Well, alternative metal. What is alternative metal? Is it something like Tool? Tool alternative metal? Is it progressive alternative metal? I don't know. Uh, D means some sometimes cool, right? D means sometimes cool. We should change the names. We should change the names. Uh, super superior. Very good. Pretty good. Good when drunk. Sometimes okay. Unlistenable. Okay. Christian metal. I never listened to Christian metal. Oh, we need another role. Of course, we need a role for don't know. Never checked it out. I don't know what Christian metal even is. Avant-garde metal. Depends if we got avant-garde black and death metal as well, but I would put avant-garde metal. Since it's getting more and more interesting to me. To pretty good. You know, I'm getting older. I need uh, meadly meadlies. <laughs> black metal. You probably expect me to put black metal in superior, but uh, I have something against that. Because black metal disappoints me a lot sometimes. Uh, a lot sometimes, pretty good. Um, because, you know, there's so much crap out there. And we have to count that as black metal as well. So that's why black metal is only very good. I think you will be surprised what uh, I wanted to put in superior, but yeah, we'll see. Blackened death metal. To me, it's a difference between black and death metal and black death metal or death black metal because black and death metal is something like uh, Belfegor or uh, Behemoth and black death metal is something like Titan Blood or uh, um, what the hell Fallen Angel of Doom you know the band yes um, that's why black and death metal is not as good. Is pretty pretty good. Good when drunk. No, it's pretty good. Okay, black and death core. What the hell is that? Black and metal core. Isn't that the same? Black and thrash metal. It's very good. Brutal death metal. I'm a big fan of brutal death metal. I gotta say, um, especially from South America. I don't know what. There's something in the water down there. In the water. They, they love brutal music and brutal death metal is brutal music. Very good stuff. Crossover thrash metal. Is that like Rage Against the Machine featuring Anthrax or whatever? I have no freaking idea what that is. I actually don't know what that is, to be honest. Crossover with what? Hip hop? No. Death metal. Was the first uh, extreme metal genre I discovered. I like death metal a lot. Death core isn't actually too bad when you're drunk. <laughs> gent, I have a gent CD. It's a uh, Field Yarta, the first Field Yarta album. I listened to it twice, and it's okay sometimes. Doom metal. Uh, not a big fan of doom metal unless it's Black Sabbath. Because Black Sabbath, you know, is still have that bluesy feeling to it. Doom metal. Yeah. I mean, I also enjoy uh, Call of the Wretched Sea sometimes, every now and then. Doom metal is pretty good. Drone metal. Is that noise? It's probably not. Is Sun O or Sun drone metal? Sometimes okay. Depressive Surhail, black metal. Yes, when I was younger, I, I really liked it and I like to write and create DSBM. You can hear that, you can feel that on the very first 
Durbatuluk demo. I don't recommend listening to it because it's crap. And uh, I think the very first video of my channel a lot of people enjoyed was the DSBM tutorial. But nowadays, it's a little boring, I gotta say. Good when drunk. DSBM and deathcore are the same style of music. That's what I'm saying. Folk metal. Um, <laughs> absolutely good when drunk. <laughs> I like it. Uh, sometimes, you know, if the folk instruments don't are not, you know, the majority. It's it's nice, I like it. Grindcore. Mm, since I started to play, play in a grindcore band five, six years ago, uh, I kind of start to understand the music first, because I always thought grindcore is just metal, but it's not metal. It, the roots are definitely in punk, in hardcore punk, and when you think about it like that, it becomes a totally different style of music, and I think grindcore is pretty good. Bands like Nasum, or Napalm Death, of course. Very nice stuff. A Document 6, such a nice grindcore band. Groove Metal. What is Groove Metal? Is it something like Soulfly? Pantera? Soulfly and Pantera, yeah, same, same genre. Uh, ah, groove Metal, I don't know. Can become pretty boring, pretty... Uh, pretty fast. But it's good when drunk. Basically everything is good when drunk, but that's a different topic. Heavy metal. I like the pure, the purest form of metal and I think heavy metal is the purest form of metal. It's awesome. Industrial metal. Same like groove metal. It get, gets boring very quickly. Uh, but since I consider Rammstein to be industrial metal, or something like that. More like Neue Deutsche Härte. But you know what I mean. I would say we cannot count, uh, we cannot put uh, this in pretty good just because Rammstein. So it's sometimes okay. Kawaii metal. That sounds Japanese, uh, but I'm not sure. I don't know what that is. Melodic death core. What is that? Melodic death metal. Depends on the band. Is at the gates melodic death metal? It is, right? Sometimes, but it, so is In Flames, and I don't like In Flames very much. Uh, pretty good when drunk, though. Melodic metalcore. Isn't that like saying wet water? Melodic metalcore or dead corpse? That doesn't make sense. I don't know what that is. Metalcore. <sighs> I'm thinking, you know, if good when drunk is worse than sometimes okay, but it's not. It's not, no. Metalcore. I know heaven shall burn, and that's it, basically. Sometimes okay. New deathcore. To me, deathcore is new. That's like, you know, dead corpse again. I don't know what that is. New metalcore, what is that? New metal. Hey. I got into metal because of new metal. Uh, Korn and Mudvayne and early Slipknot. I love that stuff. It's good when drunk. If you consider that uh, Cold Chamber and Deftones, maybe, I don't know, are considered new metal as well. Good when drunk, it's okay. It's not, it's too, it's not good enough to say it's pretty good. Pirate metal. No. Brrrr, grind. Basically the same like gore grind, just with explicit lyrics. <laughs> uh, sometimes okay. Oh, oh, I just noticed. Yeah, this is perfect. Power metal starts to grow on me. Uh, you know, four years ago I would say power metal is sometimes okay, but um, I'm really starting to enjoy the guitars and the speed of it. I gotta say, power metal is pretty good. Progressive metal. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay sometimes, but I'm not the big... Oh, we have, a, we have a category for that. Progressive metal is okay sometimes. It's good when drunk, but it's okay sometimes. Yeah. 
slamming death metal. Futures uh, Arte Nebris Medias genre. genre uh, sorry. Uh, basically, to me, the same like... Uh, <sighs> I like the, the heaviness of it, you know? The simplicity and the heaviness. It's like... Uh, what's it called? Not Decapitated. The other band. With D. Molesting the Decapitated. That's the album title. You know what I mean. Pretty good. I like that stuff. Speed metal. Basically the same like power metal, let's be honest. Symphonic metal. Not a big fan. Because too much of that symphony stuff ruins the metal experience. And I want to listen to metal, not to... It's not even okay sometimes. It's... Let's put it to unlistenable. Technical death metal. Mmm... Uh, I didn't like technical death metal before I started playing guitar, then I started playing guitar, watched these guys playing guitar and fell in love with it. Technical death metal is very good. Technical death core is probably good as well, but I have no idea what that is. Oh, you cannot even see it, right? Sorry. Ah, there you go. Progressive metal. Same. Thrash metal! The last one! And I gotta say, that's actually coincidence, because thrash metal is superior. You know why? Because I think thrash metal combines everything I like about metal. Extreme, extremism, <laughs> extreme style of music, great vocals, speed, awesome guitar riffs, um, and thrash metal never disappoints me. Even bad thrash metal bands, I like them. I love thrash metal. You might wonder, why why isn't this a thrash metal channel, since you like thrash metal so much? Uh, I don't know. I mean, thrash metal, black metal, death metal, that's my holy trinity. I love all of them, but uh, thrash metal a little more, just a little. Now don't kill me, okay? Black metal. I would still consider black metal to be my favorite style of metal, but just because of the what it does with me, but thrash metal, like I said, never disappoints me. Well, and now let's mess all that up just for the people who skip till the end immediately. All right, uh, unlistenable. <laughs> Superior power metal, because then they write stupid comments like, oh, he's making a black metal channel, but he doesn't even like black metal. <laughs> That looks good, right? Okay, let's just pretend this is my list now. For the people, you know, who skip to the end. Well, and there's the list, huh? What do you think about it? Hmm? Nice. I'm pretty happy with that. Here, uh, sub no. Subscribe to the gaming channel if you like stupid stuff. And, um, see you next time. Oh, the supporters of this channel. Thank you, guys. <laughs>